hello friends today as i said uh, in the poll linkedin post i am going to uh, share the uh, what are the operators that we might get in the execution plans and how they will get okay why if how whenever the query looks how when how we will return that how what are the operators it will uh, use to get that desired result okay so for that i am going to explain from 1 to 5 for in this video like i am going to create one table called heap okay so i am inserting one value okay and i am inserting another value see see i am as of now i inserted number 4 and number 2 in reverse order if i see here see uh, the order is not sorted data what is mean by like you know in the interview they will ask you like what is called uh, what is heap the table without cluster index is called heap what about with non cluster index so i will create one non cluster index to show you whether the data is sorted or not okay i am created now if you see here see the data is not yet sorted it means even though the table the table is having non non so many non cluster index doesn't matter it is called as heap only when it is not called heap when we have cluster index so in the interview they might ask you like when we uh, like the table without cluster index is called heap and it uh, the heap will always will go for table scan only now i am dropping this on uh, index uh, drop index uh index column and like on heap i'm dropping that okay so now if i see that the data will now what will happen so now if i do scan here and i will go with okay so i'm having table scan only okay even though even though i'm using where column where id is equal to 2 or i will use 4 i'm first one record only i'm you i'm trying to fetch the first record from the heap table if i do here if i do see of actual number of rows number of ro uh, rows read is 2 now actual number of rows for all execution is 1 see to fetch to one record it is going through like uh, two records so see in this it is sim in simple table i have only two records so now it, for two records only it is going to scanning through what about if i have 10000 it will go through 10000 records as well for fetching only one record okay so that is what heap is okay now what i am going to do i am going to create a clustered index on heap table first thing what you need to observe whether data is sorted or not see 2, 4 became down and 2 became uh, went to up. Now that data is sorted. Okay. Now the same thing. Uh, now select star from. Now I am fetching all the columns from the heap table. Uh, do you have index on? Yes, which is cluster index. If I do this thing right, do we have index on ID? And we have a cluster index, right? So when I go, when I ex execute that, I'm, even though I'm fetching all the records, it will go first, it will seek. We have using where command, it will seek, okay? And uh, all the columns. So it will seek from the clustered index. First, it will, first, this will seek operation. From where it will seek? Clustered only. Why? Because we have only one index. If I go with, see, cluster index seek. Okay. Now, uh seek only right so now i am going to select star from now it will be if i do that previously it was with table scan and it was cluster index scan see table scan or index scan are same okay so the uh, like what i mean see uh, like table scan is from heap like index scan cluster index scan is from all the index okay from the cluster index so this is a main data and it was maintained by the bt structure in the when it is a table in heap there will be no bt structure right 
so that's the reason that's the main difference but tables can almost index uh, cluster index is same almost okay not almost it's same okay now what will happen i am creating a non cluster index okay on a uh, country column okay so now i am fetching now i am fetching uh, like i am using country okay first of all uh, i am fetching the uh, records on country column do we have index on this yes which is non clustered okay how many columns are we we are fetching that to country column which is we have already so it, it will directly go to the non cluster index and will fetch the data and it will come to us okay so it will go it will show uh, yeah, what is the index like it will be uh, it will see cooperation from non cluster see it will first it will be seek and it non cluster okay now what i am doing id comma country where is this thing so now what we do, what is the execution plan it will come uh, do same formula do we have index yes country column is there in non cluster index yes id column do we have non cluster index no but we have a primary key uh, cluster index created on the id column whenever we created a non cluster index automatically na clustered information will be there in the non cluster index that's how it will go through okay so even though so now all the information will be there in the non cluster index okay which is because it's non cluster index non clustered uh, indexes will maintain cluster information key as well so this is the uh, base point that you need to remember i will write it down okay uh, non cluster indexes index um, will main will maintain maintain cluster in e uh, sir uh, cluster index information which which is usually called as clustering key okay so clustering key so this clustering key will be maintained in the non cluster index so even though even though if i am trying the column it will go first it will seek from non cluster see now what will happen now it will i am trying to fetch okay i am trying to fetch all the columns okay so now if i go with this thing where country column so where country is usa from star we have non cluster index so first it will go to the it will not go it will go through the clustered index sorry cluster index scan index scan why because we do we have index non cluster index first it will go for non cluster index and it will go to the base index it will be not like that okay so it will so the optimizer will think that okay if the columns on or everything is non cluster index within so it will go with the non cluster index seek okay so so now it will like uh, if i go here so it will be like uh, cluster index scan only so now what i will do i will use id name comma location right what is that country see id is there now with the cluster uh, country is information only we are fetching the column which is not there in the non cluster index now it will see how it will goes so even though it is it is telling that non cluster index scan is the better for this retrieve query previous if you have used data set then for on the usa country column id column it will go for seek operation remaining are like 
if you have a cluster index it is a key lookup okay and i will show you with another data set what the how the row id and key lookup will come into picture okay so if in this table what is heap we learn what is heap okay how where, what is the table scan what is cluster index seek what is cluster index scan or seek okay see screen and scan from non cluster and cluster and what is the important point one what we learn here non cluster index will also maintain cluster information which is used usually called as a clustering key now i have created a table with id name email department and i have inserted some this number of rows okay so usually taken for me 2 minutes 1 minute second okay so okay now if i go here i am enabling this thing if i go here see table scan okay now i am going to create a clustered index on id column that is done okay now uh, I am trying to use a where command. Select star from where ID is equal to where ID is equal to hundred. If I go through that, see how does the it is seek operation only we are not seeing the 100 we have why because we have a cluster index on that okay and uh, now what will happen i am going to create uh, for example uh, i am trying to uh, now just write now what happened i am trying to fetch id name department from employees table where name is equal to abc 100 okay so now what will happen on the name column we don't have any index first thing okay now if i see here clustered index scan it is going to parallelism so this is missing index uh, you can leave it okay now what will happen i am going to create a non cluster index on name and department it is done now i am going to same command see non clustered index seek it will be taken okay uh, now non cluster index now what will happen now i will remove this id column non cluster seek only okay now i am fetching name it will go again non cluster seek only see non cluster seek and key loop why because even though that's the reason in most of the cases when we uh, like see even though previously i used like three columns okay id name department okay i'm not fetching email id okay so i am fetching only all the columns from using where on where column we have a non cluster index okay but it will go first on the name it will go for the non cluster index for remaining all go to the base table we have clustered index in place that's the reason it will go into key lookup for all remaining columns okay and if i uh, what will happen i am dropping the cluster index if i do the same thing if we, it will go for rid lookup see rid lookup so it is clearly that one thing what i need to say when they are like when we have uh, when we don't have a non cluster index sorry when we don't have a, a cluster index it will seek through rid lookup row identifier when we have a cluster index it will go through the uh, key lookups okay so that's the thing that's the main difference between uh, like row identifier and key lookup how we can say which one is best which one is left because it all depends upon the data but in general if general okay so if we have cluster information then the data is sorted right so 
majority of 0.5 percent will go to the key lookups only but key lookups is also not good so we need to convert that uh, key lookups into uh, seeks or uh, seeks only by using the covering index okay so i hope uh, you understand uh, what is heap and like what is table scan what is uh, class scan and seek in clustered and non clustered and what is rid lookup and what is key lookup so in next video we will meet with another uh, execution plan operators thank you bye